Never, do not take advice from your peers, from your people in your class. Take advice from people who have gone before you and been successful. I think this is one of the best things to do, and I keep trying to tell people that. You know, well, my friends, like, they don't know. They're just like you, and a lot of people, like, lie and, like, lie about their grades and, like, pretend like they did this and that, and they didn't. So, you know, and, or they say, I didn't even barely study, and they stayed up all night and got done nothing. You know what I mean? So, so ignore your friends. Uh, use your family and discuss things with your peers. So this is when your peers do come in handy. I have a study partner that I study with all the time. First and second semester, we study all the time. Plan on making videos about each semester. Don't stop doing things that have always helped you. If you know that you succeed by group studying, get with people, study. Or I call my mom and I'll teach her stuff. Like, explain it to somebody. That's why I have the Instagram that I have. I make these videos because everyone isn't a robot. Like, everyone are different. And so, yeah, so I sometimes there's not ways to succeed that weren't cookie cutter. Um, you know just read it you know what I mean I can't learn from just just reading it you know what I mean that mm -mm. it doesn't mean even when I say read first say like when you're reading you can watch a video um make up and make up mnemonics mind palaces and memory palaces which I use and that's a whole other beast be active and uh, I already told you about I inside the boards I'm gonna listen to inside the boards um podcast the study smarter series that one it prepares you for comp and complex exams you know i feel like i i know from going through ross that there are memorizers and there are concept people i'm a concept person i'm not a memorizer uh, biochemistry was very came very naturally to me and but but anatomy did not come naturally to me so if you are a concept person then and then you need to be doing some group study stuff. Like, don't look at other people and just think, oh, I have to do like them. They're, uh-uh, they don't learn like And then make flashcards for things you don't know. As you're coming across things you don't know, um, I use Anki, I use like pre-made Anki flash hard decks because typing does not help me. Typing the cards doesn't help me anyway. So I, and if you Google Anki flash, card decks like you can just download them and then they uh go right to your phone it, i think it's 19.99 for the phone and ipad version and but it's free if you just want the computer version i think you should make physical flashcards as well so i have physical flashcards for random words i don't know but i go through anki when i am you know you know doing whatever like so let's talk about flashcards and the types of things i flashcard or that are in charts that i have them call out to me would be um, the HLA types, um, for the, the antibodies, like anti SSA or whatever it is, and anti Rho, and what those all mean. The uh, brain hemorrhages, spinal cord, um, all the charts and just facts. Um, you can flashcards those things, vocabulary words you don't know, GI hormones. Uh, who is this person? Let me put it in a flashcard. I, I think of everybody as people. Um, so those types of things you can do, also kind of do the last minute, you can do on flash charge and while wow, intermittently. So that, those are things for memorization and you definitely have to have to do them if you're not a memorizer person. But actually everyone has, at this point in the game, everybody has to do them. Cause I mean, you just have to know it's so, so cold. And concepts and memorization. So these are things like heart murmurs, which, and CNS tumors, um, uh, hypersensitivity reactions. These are the types of things you have to over and over and over keep going over. I also make, uh, every time you see it in questions, every time you see it, you've got to write it out on the board. You need to uh, memorize it and go over it. So it's a concept and it concludes the memorization because I have to memorize who's diastolic, who's systolic, and I have to understand the reason for systolic, diastolic. Like I have a decreased pressure and that causes more blood to flow in during you know inspiration or whatever it might be um so nephrotic nephritic you have to keep reinforcing over and over again this is when you're taking that 
extra time to truly understand things is on that type of topic. So know what first aid is. First aid is basically together and come together and say what was on step. And they put it in a book and they so put it in a book and say this was asked on step one this year. They just keep adding, okay, what was asked or whatever. And but anything can be asked, so don't just take it as, you know, whatever. But it's not to teach you anything. It's just, I like to think it was an psycho encyclopedia or a dictionary. And so you're using it as your master notebook. You know, you're just using it as like, I don't want to have to write all this stuff down. You still have to go and do your Ross notes or videos. You can use YouTube, Pathoma, all that. Go back and actually learn the details of the nitty gritty stuff. I could really keep talking about this, but y'all let me know what you want to go. Oh, like you want me to tell you about some even specific issues. I'm Googling the same things you are, but the things that I'm telling you, I couldn't find anywhere else. Or I'm combining things for us specifically at Ross or people specifically that are struggling to pass comp or whatever it may be. So um, let me know like what more specific things you want to talk about biocam, if you want to talk about um, the memory palaces or um drawing um i can do a drawing thing you know or whatever maybe you know whatever it may be tell me your thoughts yeah. and if, let me know if this is sufficient i know there's a lot of there's cars outside but i like doing it outside hey we're on our way to, we're on our way to the movies Saturday. hey and all that i know it's hard and it seems like a lot that you have to do, and it is, but you can do it if you, um, man, why'd you take this way? So we're going to a dollar movie right now, or discount movie, something, and so just remember to take breaks and have fun when you're not studying, because you'll go crazy. Grab me bands, girl, good luck. Show me what you got, girl, for sure.